Hey everyone, it's Tiffany. Okay, so I'm here for my 13 week pregnancy update. Today I'm exactly 13 weeks, um, Wednesday, February 20 something. Um, I don't know what today's date is. But um, before I start, I want to remind you guys to go on expectnet.com. Link will be here or in the down down below and type in Tiff's Baby 11 in the little um, search box thing in the left hand corner at the top and guess my baby's gender and length and um, date of birth and time and all the good stuff and um, whoever's closest to at the end of my pregnancy um, will get a little something something for me uh, so yeah go ahead and do that and um, it's just fun for me too, to just see what you guys think I'm having. You guys can watch my video of the boy or girl, that's the title of the video, of what I tell you guys, my symptoms and all stuff, and you guys can go off of that, or you can just guess randomly, it doesn't matter. But, uh, let's see, nothing has really changed, I keep trying to say that like every week, but, baby, it's my dog. Um, I say that every week, well, the past two weeks, but... Uh, everything, it's pretty much been the same. I had a doctor's appointment yesterday. Was it yesterday? Yesterday, the day before that? I think it was the day before that. And everything went well. Um, I had an ultrasound. They were checking from, for Down syndrome. And, uh, they had to measure the baby's neck, I guess, because, um, babies with Down syndrome have, tend to have thicker necks than, um, babies without Down, Down syndrome. And they said, from the looks of it, my baby will not have Down syndrome, but uh, they had to check my blood work just to, you know, make sure. But nine times out of ten, my baby will not have Down syndrome, so that's good. And they said the baby looked healthy. It looked, it was measuring at what it's supposed to be measuring at thir thirteen, well, twelve weeks and five days at then. So that was wonderful news to my ears. Uh, I have the pictures of the ultrasound. So the last time you guys. Saw, I think in my nine week video, the, my very first video, my pregnancy video, you guys saw my first ultrasound and the baby looked like a little tiny jelly bean and now it looks like a baby. <laughs> this is um the first picture. Oh, hold on. That's the baby's head. It's like the side. And then this is the baby upside down. <laughs> this is the head, and that's the body. Uh, the baby kept going upside down and doing all types of flips and stuff. Like I, I could see it on the big screen, the big screen, and the baby was like turning, and I saw the hand go by. My mom was like, "Look, it's waving at me." So I don't know. It was really crazy. She actually had to jiggle my stomach to get the baby to stop moving because she needed the baby to lay straight. So it was really crazy. Like she really had to push on my stomach to make her stop moving so anyways and then the last picture my favorite is this one look that's the baby's head and that's the body and this is the um hand and if you can tell the um her leg is bent his or her leg but I keep saying her because I just feel like it's going to be her her um leg is bent because her legs are crossed like that you probably can barely see but that's the other foot right there that was so cute. So, those are the ultrasound pictures. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. Like, it was crazy because last time I saw the baby was just a little tiny dot, a <laughs> little speckle. So, it was just amazing to see, you know, my baby grown like that much. So, um, my next ultrasound will be March 26th. That's when I find out what the gender is. And then I have another one on April fourth or something when they schedule me to come back. I don't know. Um, I still listen to the baby's heartbeat every single day of my life. <laughs> and if you haven't seen the video of my baby's heartbeat, um, you could look at the video of my review on this, the Sonaline, Dop Sonaline Doppler um, thingy. I think that's what it's called. But this is what I use to listen to the baby's heartbeat. And the baby's heartbeat is usually between 160 170 sometimes yeah usually between 160 and 170 so um i had to actually buy some aloe vera because i ran out of this stuff that they actually send it with so yeah that's that symptoms this week my boobs still are a little tiny bit sore uh my stomach i feel like has gotten bigger uh, we'll see when we when i show you guys at the end um um 
I still crave fruit. I still crave watermelon. I have some in the fridge. I just went grocery shopping. Um, I still crave, like, sweet stuff. Mmm. I really don't think I have any other symptoms. Everything's been going great. I have another appointment on March 2nd next week. And... Yeah, that's about it. So I guess I'll show you guys my stomach. And, um... That will be the end of this week until next week's video. <laughs> if you have any questions or anything, let me know in um, the bottom. And once again, I want to thank everybody for being so supportive. And, um, yeah. So let me show you guys my tummy. Okay, so this is my tummy from the side. Once again, this is not my belly button. This is my belly ring. And yes, to all everyone that keeps asking me, I'm going to take it out. After I buy my um, maternity ring, which is going to probably be over the weekend. So don't worry. I know it'll scar. I know it'll stretch. I'm going to take it out. Don't worry. But this is my stomach from the side. And this is it from the front. And this is it from the other side. And then this is it without the shirt on. That's my pants. This is it from the front. And this is it from the other side. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'll measure it. Again, last week I think it was 31. Or was it 30? I don't remember what it was last week. But today is 31. I don't remember what it was. I think it was like maybe 30. I don't know. But it's 31 this time. Yep. So, yeah, that's about it. And I will see you guys later. Okay? Bye.